This is Strictly Business, presented by the Greater Bakersfield Chamber of Commerce. Sponsored in part by the Law Offices of Young Woldridge, San Joaquin Community Hospital. Good morning and welcome back to Strictly Business. My name is Nick Ortiz. I'm the CEO of the Greater Bakersfield Chamber of Commerce. And I'm joined with Kristen Barnes, the CEO of the Community Foundation. Good Thank morning. you for being here, Kristen. Thanks for having me. Well, I, I wanted to, to first say, you know, um, we're we're happy to partner and really excited to be working with the Community Foundation on a number of things. Okay. Um, you know, we're, we're working on our BYP program, our Young Professionals program. You're hosting a series called Philanthropy on Tap. Correct. And we'll promote that in the upcoming one in May a little later. Um, and then also we're, we, we're really excited to be helping to promote – um, this uh, this initiative that we're going to be talking about today, which is Give Big Kern. And, you know, yes. why don't you tell us a little bit about sure. that, how people can get involved, what's been going on, and when people need to be opening up their checkbooks to all of our fabulous nonprofits in Kern County. It, you know, it is such an... It, it's it's something that's been in the works for mm-hmm. about eight months. Give Big Kern um, is part of a the National Giving Day um campaign that's sweeping the country. Last year, over $100 million was generated for nonprofits across the country. Over 9,000 nonprofits um, benefited from these giving days. We have many giving days uh, in California, Mm -hmm. to the north, to the south, but it's never been done in Kern. So we said, why not? Exactly. So May 3rd, Mm -hmm. less than two weeks, um, it is basically a 24-hour online giving campaign. Um, To put it in perspective for people, think back to the telethons of Mm -hmm. yesteryear, but using 21st century technology. Mm -hmm. Uh, So it's our way um, as the host to really um, reach out to the community to showcase the nonprofits that are in and around us, and it's all through the county. Um, And provide them with some more visibility, Mm -hmm. while also helping them raise funds. And what isn't really critical to me is not just dollars, but people can pledge volunteer hours. Oh, wow. Okay. So there's really no reason for somebody to not participate. Everybody should participate. Exactly. (laughs) Exactly. Right. Right. So how many nonprofits have you, are you working with? We have 117 that have thrown their hat in the ring, which I am so thrilled that we've had such a tremendous response from, from this group, Mm -hmm. um, for it to be the inaugural year and Mm -hmm. to have that big of a showing is amazing. Um, and, and really what's, what people can expect on May 3rd is not just going to our, the website, and mm-hmm. it is a specialized website, givebigkern.org. Um, you go log on there, search for your favorite nonprofit or cause, mm-hmm. uh, find their customized page, mm-hmm. learn a little bit more about them, and figure out how you want to donate. Um, but along with that, you will see May 3rd is a day where nonprofits will be showcasing the amazing work that they're doing. For example, Boys and Girls Club, Mm -hmm. 50th anniversary this year. They decided that May 3rd, Mm -hmm. every single one of their sites would be their birthday party. Oh, wow. So if you're near a a Boys and Girls Club, stop in for some cake and ice cream. Yeah. Sing happy birthday. (laughs) Uh, It'll be exciting. Um, ADKAC, Mm -hmm. Alzheimer's, they're having a barbecue, inviting the community in to come and see the work that they do during the middle of the day. You'll see us rolling out more and more of these events. So really a great opportunity. Um, I have a lot of people say, why? Mm -hmm. What are you doing? What are you getting out of it? And, And the reality is that... Nonprofit sustainability and strengthening is one of our strategic initiatives at yep. the foundation. And so we look at a program like this as doing three things. We're increasing visibility, we're building capacity, mm-hmm. and we're also helping to um, improve the sustainability of organizations. So not only will they benefit from increased dollars, increased volunteers, mm-hmm. increased uh, vision in the community, but they're also, since the first of the year, we've had training sessions where they're learning social media and the impact of 
collective working together, mm -hmm. um, how to engage new donors, how to engage your board. Mm -hmm. um, so we're really helping um, to build some much needed skills, I think, in the community. Yeah. I mean, uh, you're almost acting like a chamber of nonprofits in a number of ways uh, recently. I think, you know, back to not just our um, partnership with Philanthropy on Tap, which is, you know, really about showcasing individual nonprofits right. all throughout the community to young professionals in Kern County and getting them engaged in philanthropy or finding a cause that they want to donate their time to. Um, but also the work that you've been doing around building endowments um, for nonprofits so that they have, you know, sustainable um, finances and can plan and, and create um, the, the structure through which that they can maybe do something big in the future, whether that's a, a building, whether that's, you know, something that continues to, to fund their operations. Exactly. You're, you're doing a lot around really trying to um, – raise up and provide resources for our nonprofit community here in Kern County. But when you think about it, um, there's hundreds of nonprofits in, in Kern County, believe it or not, and people are often shocked, literally hundreds. And if you think about a life cycle, uh, a, a nonprofit, just like a business or, mm -hmm. or anything else, has a life cycle. And, and on that cycle, we have nonprofits that are virtually at every single point on that cycle. Mm -hmm. um, we have those that are thinking about becoming a nonprofit. We have those that have been in business for 50 years and are quote, needing to rethink and re-strategize or, you know, whatever the case may be. And, and you're exactly right. That's what we view our role as. You know, how can we assist and how can we best help? Because at the end of the day, a community foundation is good to help people organize their philanthropy and help mm -hmm. them with their giving, but really the heart of a community foundation is to improve the community and make it a better place. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Definitely. So um, do people need to do any pre-homework in order to get engaged for Give Big Kern, or can they wait till the third? Or You can, <laughs> <laughs> you can wait to the third, uh -huh. or you can actually go on the website right now. You mm -hmm. can pledge now. Um, you can check out your favorite uh, nonprofit, or you can just investigate. Um, mm -hmm. We have 10 different categories to search by, um, and it is quite amazing. Uh as like I said, we're going all the way out to Ridgecrest, up to the Kern River wow. Valley, um, but just quite a spectrum of, of organizations. So I encourage people log on now, check mm -hmm. it out. Um, if you have any questions at all, clearly you can um, reach out through our website or you can give us a call. But um, I would say too, reach out to your favorite nonprofit mm -hmm. and say, hey, what are we doing for Give Big Kern? Mm -hmm. um, you know, it's it's a fabulous opportunity. That's great. One other thing that I know you all do and that I think is really cool, and I actually need to uh, call your office to get one, is, you know, the giveaway that we do at Philanthropy on Tap, which is the, the giving card, which yes. is like a gift card that you can give to somebody who, you know, basically has everything um, right. or, you know, as a, a, a very generous community spirit, um, you know, and you can give them a gift card that they can reach out to the community foundation and that de denomination will be contributing to a nonprofit of their choice. Right. It's like a, it's like a, a nonprofit or a philanthropic ATM card, right? <laughs> uh, so we encourage people to, like you said, give mm -hmm. them as gifts. Mm -hmm. um, we can customize them for businesses if they want to use them to thank uh, customers or things like that. Um, and then uh, at the, in the quiet of your home, yeah. wherever you'd like, you log on mm -hmm. and um, you've got this little gift certificate. You mm -hmm. find not just um, for nonprofits here in town, but mm -hmm. it can go throughout the world. Oh, wow. Um, so uh, you can really have some fun with it. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, people, um, you know, great hostess gifts, great Christmas gifts, uh, just thinking about you kind of a gift. Yeah. And, and like you said, we can um, load them with any denomination mm -hmm. that people people would like. Um, and, you know, that, that kind of circles back to Give Big Kern. Um, so uh, one of the things that I really love is that – smartphone, tablet, PC, yeah. you can sit in your pajamas and you can be part of Give Big Kern, right? Yeah. And get that giving feeling and feel like all warm and fuzzy. <laughs> 
Well, that is great. And so uh, give us the information again on where we go. What's the URL to go to? It is givebigkern.org. Great. And, and it's May 3rd. May 3rd. But yeah. start now. Start now. Start early. Start now. <laughs> and I will say that 100% of the net proceeds mm-hmm. go directly to those nonprofits that oh, are awesome. working hard for that. Uh, we, we have partnered with a company called Razu, mm-hmm. um, who does all of the technology and the platform. Mm-hmm. They do the Silicon Valley yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, Giving Day, and I so we vetted that and felt yeah. like it was okay. Was, yeah, they um, were up to it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So our goal is to uh, show the the nonprofit, or excuse me, the community foundations that are around us. Yeah, uh, Sacramento area, mm-hmm. Silicon Valley, Orange County. They all have Giving Days. Yeah, raising in the millions um, in one day. Oh. So uh, we're ready. Yeah. We're, we're going to join the pack. Oh, Kern County can best them. Come on. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> We'll get there. (laughs) Well, thank you for being here, Kristen. Thank you for all that you and your staff at the Community Foundation do um, for our broader community, but also for our nonprofits. Um, Please stay tuned. We'll be back in just a few minutes. This is Strictly Business.